Welcome back. Right now we're taking a live look at the launch pad at the Kennedy Space Center out in Cape Canaveral, Florida. The historic Dragon launch is set for this afternoon. Two American astronauts are taking the trip to space on board a private spacecraft. Of course, hopefully weather will permit all of this to happen, but this could be a game changer when it comes to America's space program and private space flight. They are traveling on a SpaceX spacecraft, and that's the company owned by Elon Musk. This is also the first time in nearly a decade NASA astronauts are getting ready to launch into space from U.S. soil. And one business right here in Southern Nevada is playing a role in today's moment in American history, the same as they have for more than 50 years. 13 Action News reporter Sean Delancey is live right now in Boulder City with a look at Fisher Space Pens. And Sean, these pens have really been out of this world. Yes, Kalina, just taking a look at this pen, it, it appears to be normal, but I'll tell you, it is anything but normal. The astronauts who are launching today will see several just like them when they get to the International Space Station, and they all come from this factory right here in Boulder City. Uh, Fisher Space Pens have been on every American mission into space since Apollo 7 in 1968. They're the only ballpoint pens in the world that can write in zero gravity. Regular pens won't write, and early astronauts found pencil lead could obviously break, sending graphite floating around the ship. Graphite can fry electronics, obviously something that you do not want while rocketing through the vacuum of space. National sales manager Joshua Fisher says that this company is rooted in history, and it's cool to at least be a small part of another challenge. Chapter. We can't wait for the launch today. We hope that the conditions are going to be great and that the launch is successful. We're praying for everybody. Uh, captains, both of the captains on that flight, we're really praying for them. We sent them an engraved pen as well, too, from Fisher Space Pen, so they got that before their flight. Um, hopefully, they're bringing it with them when they fly. Uh, Fisher says even if the captains didn't bring their personal space pins with them, there are 51 of them up on the International Space Station right now. Space tech isn't the only innovation that is coming out of this factory. One of the brands of pins that they're selling right now, their sales have skyrocketed since the beginning of the coronavirus pandemic. I'll tell you why that is coming up at 3. But for now, Sean Delancey, 13 Action News. Very cool, Sean. Thank you so much. And you can watch the launch right here on Channel 13. ABC will air a special report starting around 1.15 this afternoon. If bad weather scrubs the launch, they'll try again on Saturday.